So in today's video, I'm going to be sharing how to create that dreamy effect in your photos using Vaseline. Maybe you own one of these. This is a Pro Mist filter and it creates that misty, hazy look in your photos. But most of the time they're around 150 bucks and the trick that we're gonna apply today will create the same effect, if not better. And it will only cost you five bucks. So what you're gonna need is some Glad Wrap, some Vaseline and some elastic bands. And the whole reason why we're gonna use Glad Wrap is because we don't want to put the Vaseline on our lens because it will just mess up your lens. So I'm gonna bring you along on a little portrait shoot we're gonna do here in Chinatown, Melbourne. And the lens I'm gonna be shooting with is the Sigma 50mm f1.4 and I'm gonna be shooting with the Canon R6. All right, let's pack our bags and let's go. What? I have no idea if it's gonna work. <laughs> Just put it on as tight as possible. Oh my god. Do you want to, um. <laughs> what do you think, Sabrina? Yeah? Yeah. You know what? If this works, this is a camera hack for sure. Alright, this is the interesting part. This is the moment. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, wait, let me just pause myself here. The whole reason why I'm applying the Vaseline in a V-shape is because I want to have that dreamy effect around the corners of my photo, like this. And I want to have Sabrina's face still in focus and nicely sharp. But you can also apply the Vaseline fully over the whole glad wrap and that will create a nice dreamy hazy effect over the whole photo. And that's what makes it so awesome to use glad wrap because you can just take it off as many times as you want, creating different patterns, which will create a different atmosphere to your photo. Like this um, the thingy. Oh. oh, that is so cool. That is actually beautiful. That is so cool. All right. <laughs> it's actually good. Man. Okay, let's get started. That's so nice with the Vaseline. I'm jealous. I want to be shooting. <laughs> oh my god. What? What the heck, Drop right? That. It's so pretty. Yeah, looking into the camera. Nice. <laughs> nice. Beautiful. That's a nice light as well. Come. Your face up a little bit. Yes, yeah, so and have some lighting in your face. Nice. Looking that way a little bit. Yes. Me and Faye were just talking about like how you're really like quick with going from like one location to another. Yeah. And what? Why is that? Because I feel like the more locations, the better. Because you have just such different atmospheres to photograph as well. And like the thing is, like, because it can be, I feel like, very easy, like as a creative, to just kind of like stick to the same location and like try to get the perfect shot. But I feel like you're good at just like being like bam, bam, move on to the next thing, which bam, is it bam, makes bam. it fun. Like yeah. it makes it fun doing that. Exactly. Like, and it keeps the speed in the shoot a little bit. And most of the time, my portrait shoots take about an hour to an hour and a half, so quite fast. But yeah, I like working that way because that way we're both very high in energy the whole shoot and I think an hour is plenty, so. If you sit here, I think we have a bit of a glow on your face. Yeah. You can use that, so let's give that a go. Nice. 
Yes, and then chin up a little bit. Nice. What are your thoughts, Vi? It's so dreamy. It's exactly how I hoped it would work out. So it feels good. What's up? All right, let's walk back all the way to the car park again, because that's where I want to shoot next. Awesome. Let's go. No photos. <laughs> Sabrina, do you reckon we're gonna get kicked out? No. We're, we're all fine. good. Yeah. We're fine. We haven't been kicked out. Oh. The lights turned on. The lights turned on. A bit of and I'm really like leaning over the edge. Yeah, that's nice. How are the photos going up here given that like you've used the Vaseline? Do you think it works in this location well? Oh yeah, it does work because we have a bit of backlighting from all the street lights down there. But I want a bit more Vaseline just to enhance that effect a bit more. And I also just want to see what it looks like if I just add a shitload of Vaseline on my lens. <laughs> <laughs> Every time we get kicked out, but we didn't get kicked out this time. Maybe they gave up. They were like, oh, that's them again. Maybe like, oh, maybe they're actually taking good photos once, but oh. they've stayed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, let's go to the next one. Otherwise, I can keep shooting. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> Your reactions are priceless, Faye. Holy shit. <laughs> Afterwards, when I'm editing, I'm like, for fuck's sake. <laughs> They're literally taking up the whole side. Yeah. It's but it's necessary. <laughs> yeah. I like the one you're like full on leaning on the yeah. So Faye, yeah. what's going on? We did it! We got all the shots. So I am very, very happy with all the shots we got. Big thanks to Sabrina. She's amazing to work with. Yeah, I can't wait to start editing these. Well done. Nice. <laughs> you can't high five my high five <laughs> I had so much fun testing out this trick for you. And I've noticed that when we were using the Glad Wrap, it already created a nice diffusing effect over the whole photo. So when we applied the Vaseline, it already blended so nicely with the rest of the image. So not only using the Vaseline, but also using the Glad Wrap created such a cool effect. So yeah. And when it came down to the editing of these photos, I went for a bit of a warmer tone to the photos and I took out quite a bit of clarity to enhance that dreamy effect even more. And that is it. So I hope you enjoyed watching my video and I also hope to see you in the next one. Okay, bye-bye. Doei. What's going uh, on? Well, first off, I put my phone at like this edge where the trunk closes. So the trunk closed on my phone and now it's a bit cracked. Oh no. But wait, wait, tilt it back a bit. There it is, you can see that crack. <laughs> Oopsie. Cracking. Yep. I'm so nervous. Yeah, I'm really nervous too. It's gonna be fucking radical. <laughs>